yeah, it's been really weird. <laughs> that may be the best way to describe wanting to have senioritis and it never coming. You wanted to be back in school. You wanted to see the people every day and be with your teachers and have those last moments. When classes were cut short and graduation canceled, they created a plan to come together on this night. So what we're going to do is we're going to spend the next like 30 minutes decorating our cars, getting them to look all cute, all that good stuff. With classmates like Jesse Bartell hoping for some normalcy in unprecedented times. I think it's just kind of emotional because you've been looking up to this for not only the past four years of high school, but basically like the past 13 years you've been in school. And this class looked forward to graduation more than most. Our sixth grade year was the flood of 2013, and now our senior year is like, not ruined, but you know, we got to disrupt it. Yes. <laughs> the 2013 floods disrupted school back then. Recovery at times forced these friends physically apart. And I think that that's something that maybe without knowing it prepared for this. But they've always found a way to come back to each other. Their names won't be announced from a grand stage this weekend, but their parents still cheered at a parade for 40. Sometimes life isn't going to go at all how you expected, even if you've been expecting like one thing for 18 years, that might not happen. 40 graduates who tonight had their final lesson at Lions High School. In Lions, Ryan Herrer, 9 News.